Before the proper start of the video, I just want to say that I have no, I no longer have Camtasia Studio 8, which was my main editing software that I used, and this is my second, this is a re-upload of the Celtic video, and basically, I, the main action from the match, it will have a Filmora watermark over it, because I used about four or five different editing softwares trying to just tr just trying to uh, see what was going to be best and I'm currently using Windows Movie Maker and I'm not really enjoying it at all so it's going to take me a wee while to adapt to get comfortable with an editing software because I I've used Camtasia for about a year, uh, uh, 16 months actually so it's it's going to take a while to readjust. This video will not be as good as future videos because I've, I'm still getting used to it. The reason why the action, the match action, has got a watermark over the front of it is it is transparent, but it, it's just because that was actually the best one I'd done over five different platforms, and literally it's I know it's a pain. But surely you can see through it. It was literally the best what I've done, and and the editing software I used for it, it's like a hundred dollars, and I'm I really don't have the money at the moment to pay for it. So, I'm if if you've got any ideas of any editing software that I could get for free or anything like that, that I, that could that is similar to Camtasia Studio. Those, those nerds out there, just hit me up and just let me know. But anyway, enjoy. Hey guys, Gogs are here, and welcome to episode 75, three quarters to a century of Around the Grounds videos. And today, it's the League Cup second round, Celtic v Motherwell, and yeah, it's about quarter past one, and I'm basically going to make a day out of it. I'm gonna get like the four minutes to two train from Cooper, and then I'm feeling fruity today, so I'm gonna change it to Dundee and get into Glasgow Queen Street, and then we're meeting uh, some of the lads at, at Glasgow Central. So here we go. I'm really looking forward to today. Um, I'm actually confident we can actually cause a shock because we've we've done that we've done it before, did it last season, and of course Celtic will be focusing on their friendly against Inter Milan and the Champions League next week. So, we've, we've got a chance tonight. I'll, I'll just say that. But yeah, let's let's go. Come on the well. So we're going tonight with strawberries and raspberries. And we're, going, we're only going to remember the second last time I was there to, at Celtic Park. Because the last time we got beat 7-0. Well, didn't even know that. But uh, yeah, that game didn't really matter because it was last game of the season. No change to the league whatsoever was going to be made. So, it's open. Glasgow Queen Street. Glasgow Queen Street, where this train will terminate. Please ensure that you take the bus. <laughs> so Adam, what have you got today? Regular nine nugget meal. Oh, aye, fair <coughs> enough. Yeah. What have you got, Chancey? Food. <laughs> Tit. No, what, what specific food do you have? Lettuce. <laughs> lettuce. Well, let us get onto mine. And yeah, I've got the I usual. It, it can jump. Oh. <laughs> there you go, 
Oh, thanks. That's all I ever wanted. Banter. So we're going to go for predictions now. What's your predictions, boys? 1-0, one no mother. 1-0, one no mother. I like the say of that. 2-1. Two 2-1. One. Two one. Just like when you won. Yeah, I think we're going to win 7-6. It's, it's going to be that sort of game. Bounces all over the... No, realistically, I think we'll, we'll squeeze a 1-0. No. We'll squeeze a 1-0. No. We'll win, or we'll win on penalties or something stupid like that. One Big Marvin Johnson. But yeah, six two down. <laughs> Johnson and Yukovic scored. <laughs> Aye, but here, here's hoping that we sneak through to the next round. Maybe get Alo away. That'd be great. My life here. Could Gogsy do it? Is this going to be the shot? Oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> it's the shot. <laughs> so Gogsy, why is it up? Again, and <laughs> misses. Again. The pressure got to me, alright? Right, that's the team just got out. I will do it. So now it's 20 past midnight. I'm gonna have to go to bed. At least, you know, there's a fiver for a ticket. So I paid a pound for each goal I saw tonight. But we were. We were atrocious. We really were. We really need to up our game a bit if we want to compete. And <clears throat> it's always nice to have a wee cup run, but it's not often you play five matches in the cup and get beat twice. <laughs> Just saying. But hopefully we can go to St. Jo go to St. Johnson at home on Saturday and 
still bounce back. We need, we need to show our resilience and we need to kick on because if we play like we did tonight, I mean, we had, we had chances. We should have scored our chances. If we play like we did tonight though, against St. Johnson, we will get beat. We really will. But yeah, now it's time to go to bed. Ah, <sighs> oh, thank God it was only just a dream. Got you with that one.